and uh, there are some interesting uh, activities taking place uh, in a part of China we're going to cross live to in a moment. Uh, just to explain, archaeologists are excavating a set of tombs belonging to noble families in the Western Zhou dynasty. And that dates back to 771 BC in the city of Baoji in northwest China's Shangxi province. A number of bronzewares have been unearthed and they've also found another tomb inside where they expect to find valuable relics. For the latest, let's cross to our reporter Wu Lei, who's at the site. Uh, good to have you uh, with us, Wu Lei. Just uh, explain to us the progress that's been made there so far, the new finds, and what will the archaeologists be doing over the next few days? Right, Edwin. Now I'm standing in the one of the tombs named M4 in Shigu Mountain of Baoji Province. Actually, since last July, I still remember that at that time, the archaeologists had found one of the tombs named M3, and they have found more than uh, 20 pieces of bronze wares, and uh, that tomb is 20 meters away from the place I'm standing now, that that means that during the uh, the last few months, that the archaeologists have surveyed this yeah, land okay. and they have found dozens of tombs. And uh, this one is one of the largest uh, tombs. And I talked to the archaeologist Wang Zhangkui from the Shanxi Provincial Institute of uh, Archaeology, and he was very excited about the tombs he found and uh, the difference he said uh, with this one because uh, this tomb and they have detected more than 40 pieces of bronze wares and there are, mo there are eight recessed niches in these uh, tombs and uh, the archaeologists have detected six of them and uh, the, in the following days they will clear the, two, the remaining two and let's see one of the recessed niches, uh, bronze wares. As we can see the first one the bronze wares are named differently according to their functions. The first one, they are called, it is called yan. It is used, majorly used for cooking, uh, cooking meals. And uh, the second one behind, he, behind it, it is named uh, uh, lei. Uh, it is named gui as a major container for holding grains. And as we can see, it's very delicately made. And it's very hard to believe that all these of these bronze wares are made over 2,000 years ago. And the third one in the middle is called lei. It's a major container for holding liquid or drinking vessel. And the archaeologists have found that uh, there are more than uh, eight to 40 pieces of bronze wares, but in the M3 container, M3 tomb we found last year, there are on, on 20 pieces, which means that the more, the more bronze wares are buried with the owner of the tomb, the higher social status it will be for him. So, uh, so the archaeologists uh, during the, in the next few days, they will continue to unearth this tomb and uh, who will be the owner of the tomb and whether there will be some important inscriptions on these uh, bronze wares. As we know that Baoji is uh, named as a landmark of the bronze ware and the Western Zhou dynasty and so it's a very uh, important uh, capital for the dynasty and uh, there are many uh, hundreds of thousands of bronze wares unearthed in this place. So uh, what kind of information can this tomb can uh, reveal to the archaeologist and uh, uh, we will follow the, uh, uh, the scientist to uncover these secrets buried for more than 2,000 years. Edwin. Thanks very much. Um, interesting report and uh, you often get these assignments where some of these archaeologists discoveries are being reported so it's always good to have you uh, on the job again.